How's it going, guys? My name is Eric Van. I would rather not do any of these things. Thank you very much. And welcome to a website activity called Would You Rather. So basically what this website's going to do is it's going to ask me, would you rather do this or would you rather do that? There's going to be two choices. They're both probably going to be weird and it's going to be hard to choose between them. Like, for example, it might be like, would you rather lick cheesecake off of your dad's face or would you rather lick a burrito off of a porn star's butthole? Probably be something... Well, actually, my mind comes up with weird things. I don't know if it's going to be anything like that. But you kind of get the gist of it. Let's just get started. The first question we have is... Would you rather constantly have a runny nose or constantly have Cheetos cheese-covered fingers? You know, for this, this is... So easy for me, because as a gamer, how am I supposed to game when I have Cheetos cheese-covered fingers? I could still do it, but the controllers would just be a constant mess. And it would be a cesspool for bacteria, because I'd be <laughs> licking them up, and, and I'd be playing games, and no, no way. There's nothing that pisses me off more than, like, a greasy controller. Someone that, like, doesn't wash their hands often, and then they pick up the controller and they hand it to you, and it's, like, slimy. You know, that's- it's just the worst. So no, I'm gonna, I would rather constantly have a runny nose, thank you very much. I can just shove Kleenex up there. Oh my god, I can't believe that's so close! I thought a lot of people would rather have a runny nose! I'll just shove some Kleenex up there, I can breathe out of my mouth. <gasps> it's fine. Next question! Would you rather have loved and lost, or have never loved at all? Oh my god! So emotional! Emotions! Have loved and lost, or never loved at all? Mm. Mm, mm, have loved and lost, obviously, because you can love again, or never loved at all. No, no, I don't want forever alone. Yeah, there's, that's an obvious one, it's so easy. Would you rather live in the Star Wars universe, or live in the Star Trek universe? Okay, you know, I love Star Trek, but Star Trek is basically like, everything comes from Earth, and they're exploring the galaxy now. Star Wars is like, yeah, I'm gonna become a Jedi and have force powers and use the force and there's a lot of other, like, uh, spiritual stuff involved with it. So I'm gonna say in the Star Wars universe, thank you very much. Uh, most people agree. Would you rather have a child in seventh grade and raise it or never have kids slash adopt? What? Uh, that's a weird question. Um, I never... Uh, just whatever, have a child in seven. Oh, I see! I'll be in the seventh grade and I've got to raise it! Oh my- No way! That's- That's way too young! That kid would grow up to be a messed up child. Me in the seventh grade, I was already a naughty, naughty child. I would just never have kids. No way. <laughs> would you rather be a cat or be a dog? Ah! Oh, that's tough! People are gonna murder me for my answer on this one! I would rather be a cat, because I can just lie around and not give a shit. Okay, I, I was losing my train of thought a little bit. I'm gonna go with being a cat, because I like to jump places, get more maneuverability and exploration, and that sounds fun. A dog is cool. I, I love dogs because they're loyal and they're so sweet, but cats can just get to higher places, and I'd love, if I was gonna be an animal, I'd love to be able to do all these crazy, like, acrobatics and stuff. So I'm just gonna say be a cat. Most people would rather be a dog, though. I mean, dogs are stronger, right? All the dogs, if I was a cat, the dog would just look at me and be like, Hey bro, you even lift? And I'd be like, whatever, I'm jumping from the trees, meh. So yeah. And you know, that question isn't which one do you like more, okay? People are gonna be like, oh my god, I love dogs! Eric, go to hell, I love dogs! No, it's, calm down, okay? Before you start commenting, so just calm the hell down. Anyways, would you rather have a college slash university named after you? Have a sports stadium named after you? Rather have a college and university named after you? The College of Eric Van Wilderman? Hell yeah! A sports stadium? Whatever. They're like, oh, he must have been like a sports player back in the day that we don't really give a shit about anymore. But a college university and university? Scholarly pursuits? Hell yeah. They'd be like, Eric Van Wilderman was probably a genius if he had a college named after him. Yeah. Hell yeah. College university, baby. Uh. If you were given the responsibility, would you rather inform a room of first grade students that their favorite pets have died tragically? <laughs> Explain to a room of first grade students how sex works in graphic detail. Well, sex works in graphic details better than their favorite pets dying tragically. I would explain to them and uh, whatever, explain how sex works. Big deal, they'd probably forget it and be like, oh well, whatever. 
Uh, actually, I don't know about that. But whatever, I mean, informing them that their favorite pets have died tragically, that's, like, terrifying. That would, like, horrify the shit out of them. Sex, whatever. They'd just be like, yeah, it's grass, ha, pay, pay. Whatever, sex. Would you rather live in isolation? Face your biggest fear once a month. What is my biggest fear? Yo, one of my biggest fears, this is like a very unrealistic fear, would be like being buried alive. Yeah, right. Like I'd want to be buried alive once a month. I don't, I don't think that'd be very good. So, um, you can go live over in that forest or we're going to bury you alive once a month. I'll live in the friggin' forest. Just someone give me internet so I can play in online games okay <laughs> yeah face your biggest fear once a month no way not my biggest fear no <laughs> would you rather eat a hot dog or eat a hamburger uh, that's so easy i'd rather eat a hamburger fuck hell yeah although i st there's still rooms for hot dogs in my life i still like the occasional hot dog but no way hamburger all the way if i had a choice would you rather lose the ability to feel emotions or be physically paralyzed <gasps> jesus that's deep that's insane! No way emotions be physically paralyzed though I couldn't do anything? But- Oh my god! So I couldn't feel fun, so even though I was gonna like, try to do hobby stuff? No? Oh my- Oh my god! Oh my god! What would I do? Cause a lot of people would think like, you lose the ability to feel emotions, you could just be a bad boy. But no, you couldn't be a bad boy! Be because you wouldn't have the emotions to feel good about the bad things that you're doing. You just wouldn't care about anything. You wouldn't care. Yo, no. Uh, fuck, be physically paralyzed. I would just have to hope that there were things that I could use to control with my voice or something. Oh my god, lose the ability to feel emotions? Jeez. Would you rather be unable to open doors unassisted, or be unable to climb stairs unassisted? That's a crazy one. I would rather... Be unable to climb stairs. Elevators, guys. Come on. Elevators! Would you rather get gas every time you are around the sex you are attracted to? <laughs> burp after every time you kiss. Um, I would rather burp after every kiss because if I got gas every time I was around someone that I was attracted to, then when it actually came time to get jiggy with it, it'd be like, <laughs> and there would just be, it would be terrible, okay? I'd rather say, hey, I'm sorry, I like, I, I don't like kissing, and then we, we just do our biz, okay? Yes, burp after every time you kiss, easy answer. Get gas, no way. Hey, I'm just, um, I know we've been uh, dating for a while, and it's time for us to take the next step. <laughs> ah, no way. Would you rather eat a spoonful of cinnamon or snort mustard? Um, apparently a spoonful of cinnamon it can, like, kill you. Well, I don't know if it can kill you, but, like, it can be so dry, like, there's the cinnamon challenge where people have eaten it and they just, like, spit it out immediately. Because it, you can't eat a spoonful of cinnamon. It, apparently, it, it is so bad for you. I'd rather just snort mustard, then. Why people would rather eat cinnamon?! You're gonna die! You kids are all dead! All 567,000 of you! Yeah. Would you rather raise a family with Samuel L. Jackson or raise a family with Vin Diesel? <laughs> I don't even care. I'm indifferent. It wouldn't wouldn't matter. I gotta raise a family with one of them. Um, fuck. Samuel L. Jackson, sure. <laughs> Would you rather have a lightsaber? Have a helper monkey. Lightsaber! No shit! Would you rather go on a magic carpet ride with Jasmine? Take Cinderella to the ball. Oh, take... I took Cinderella to the ball and we had a dance and then she ran away. Or I went on a friggin' magic carpet ride with Jasmine and we sang songs the whole way and saw a beautiful new world. Jasmine. Duh. Sorry, Cinderella. You're boring compared to Jasmine. <laughs> Hate to say it. Would you rather wear- oh, the KK robe. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> wear the KKK robes for life? Tattoo swastikas on both sides of your cheeks. <laughs> ah! I don't know, I'd rather- God, that's hard, I don't want to do any! I'd rather tattoo swastikas on both sides of my cheeks, because what I could do is I could wear, like, a ski mask or something. Let's go with the swastikas. No, why would you wear the KKK robes? You can't take them off. People are gonna think you're KKK. Would you rather eat 300 donuts in four hours for $500? Drink a cup of sour milk for $50. 300 donuts? That's a shitload! You freaking die! Sour milk. 
You couldn't do it. You'd die. You'd be dead. I'll try it. For all you 523,000 people, I'm gonna find you and I'm gonna shove 300 donuts in your mouth and your stomach and you're gonna friggin' explode into a big colory mess of donuts. Yeah, good luck to you guys. Would you rather be stupid and have a brilliant kid? <laughs> be brilliant and have a stupid kid. Um, God, I, I'm selfish. I'd rather be brilliant to have a stupid kid. I'm sorry, because I could t t entertain the stupid kid. I'd be like, hey, stupid kid, let's go and... Oh, well, I wouldn't call him stupid kid, because that's mean. I'd say, let's go play video games and he'd be happy, right? And, and that's cool, as long as he's happy and lives a happy life. It's cool, and I'd be brilliant. I'd have mo lots of money, because I'd be brilliant. But if I was stupid and had to take care of a brilliant kid, the brilliant kid would be like, Hey, daddy, can you enroll me in all these, like, extracurricular activities because I'm a friggin' genius? And then I'd be dumb, like, oh, Give me another beer! Fuck you! Right? It just wouldn't work out. Sorry. Would you rather bring people back from the edge of death, but each time takes a year off your life? Ooh. Be able to grant wishes, but each time you forget a beautiful, meaningful memory from your past. Ooh. Bring people back from the edge of death, but each time takes a year off your life. I'd rather have that one, because I could save a select couple people. But I would probably never use the ability. <laughs> I would never use it. Eric, come on, save me. Be like, sorry. I just I have this power, but I'm never going to use it. Unless it was like someone I loved. If it was like a significant other that was dying, I'd use it for one year. I'd be like, significant other, don't divorce me, because you know what? You know what? I shaved a year off my life for you. That's right. Would you rather show your friends and family your entire internet history? Live near an active volcano. <laughs> Live near an active volcano. <laughs> oh my god, more people would say that! <laughs> Man, people are crude! People are messed up! Oh my god! <laughs> Would you rather eat Lay's potato chips, eat Pringles? No shit. Would you rather be a character on Lost, be a character on Heroes? Heroes! Fuck yeah, not on Lost. Would you rather have uncontrollable diarrhea, have uncontrollable vomiting? Uncontrollable diarrhea. At least it's near, oh, that's 50%, oh jeez. Vomiting, like your whole body convulses. Diarrhea, you could just sit there. I could, you, I could not play like 3DS or like a handheld gaming device if I was vomiting, but I could if I had diarrhea. I just sit on the can and be like, get a TV installed in my bathroom. I'm set. Friggin perfect. Would you rather sleep in a tanning bed for a month, sleep in a small suitcase for a month? Tanning bed, you, you get cancer. Small suitcase, you'd be like all like really cramped up. Wouldn't have room to stretch. Tanning bed, you get cancer though. I'm like, small suitcase. I don't want them cancers. Would you rather be killed by Jason, be killed by Ghostface? Um, Jason, because he's stronger. He's not. Ghostface is a human. Jason is not human. Jason would just be like, and like hit you with a sledgehammer, and you'd just die in a hit. Would you rather meet your idol, be popular at school? Uh, I don't give a shit about meeting famous people, so I'd rather be popular at school. <laughs> I don't give a shit. Okay, anyways, guys, I'm gonna end the episode here. I hope it was good fun for you. It was good fun for me. Hope it was as good for you as it was for me. Mm, it was nice. Super nice. Anyways, I'll see you in future videos on the channel. Remember to leave a like down below. Tell me what you thought about this video. It's a little bit different than what I normally do, but I thought it was a good time. Thought uh, you guys got to know me a little bit. Maybe that's a bad thing, because <laughs> I choose to live near an active volcano than for you guys to see my internet history. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you in future videos on the channel. As always, guys, peace.